I really want to work with teenagers and I thought that having a mentor would have been really good for me when I was a teenager as well. A once in a lifetime opportunity is very valuable and it gives you all the experience and it points you in the right direction of full time work. I signed up to be a mentor because I myself was mentored uh, at university and also in some of my job based placements and I found it an invaluable uh, process to have somebody that was uh, more experienced um, giving me a real insight so the, the idea was to to go through the same process and to give something back. Um, I think seeing that it's not actually as scary as you think it has, it will be, um, getting to see what work is actually like, and meeting professionals and being with someone that you know is actually there to help you. The, the initial stage is just having someone to talk to who actually knows what you're going through and can, you know, because I didn't have any idea at all. I was just, you know, my partial sight was very sudden and, you know, I didn't know anybody at all that, you know, and I didn't know what to do. So, you know, just, just having someone to talk to who knows what, knows what you're going through and is in the same, the same position. You know you're not alone. They've got all different kinds of things that while they're in the group. And so it doesn't make you feel like if you were joining a group, for example, in a community centre or that, you would feel a bit more, it'd be more daunting seeing how they progress and how they get confidence and actually try things that they never have tried before. I think the mentoring programme is a good way for people to um, get involved with young people in their communities um, and to give something back. I think the main benefit for the students so far has been um, just to see um, the workplace and, and what goes on. I think it's difficult sometimes from a student point of view, if you don't have work experience, to understand just how um, uh, training can translate into a real job. Probably the, the triangle of support that, that I get through me, the mentee and, and, and move on, um, to be able to come in and, and, and talk to the staff if and when uh, I get any problems or anything like that, right now, because it's good knowing that that's there been involved with people because I'm disabled and that and don't have the a white family group round about me and things like that and I'm not involved in lots of other things then the mentoring service and other services and government opportunities allows me to be involved in things. I've been out kind of, um, before I had my mentor I was tend to stay in all the time never go out kind of never go out um, I was just getting depressed and well, Heather got me coming out, kind of would go and do things, kind of maybe go for cups of tea. Just the fact that kind of got out and started to get out more often, that that helped me. My mentee, uh, one of them, um, was an old lady who had just been diagnosed with macular degeneration and was not in a good place, but came on through time, through chatting, lots of chatting, lots of phone calls. Um, to make her day a bit brighter. We were talking about things that were happening in Coronation Street and she seemed to enjoy that. And we would meet, both make comments and this is the type of thing that I spoke to her about was taking the seat, a small seat, up to the television so that you can see it. What little sight you have got, make use of it. I'm more confident now about going out and I actually don't really, it's just not that I don't care if people are judging me now, but I feel less um, ashamed. Uh, the big one for me has been the development of the relationship and uh, just seeing the young person uh, from the beginning of the, the mentoring to the, where, I, where I'm at just now at the end. Networking, meeting lots of people, seeing around the studios, um, my mentor took me on a tour, um, getting to sort of see how people work and also learning about how he got to his position. I think what's been most rewarding about the programme is seeing the uh, mentee develop, um, coming in in the initial stages, unsure in terms of, of what to do and where to go, and then by the end of the programme actually having the confidence to take areas that, uh, that we've explored and actually put them into practice into the professional world. Well, if anyone could have told me that it was possible to change so much in such a short time, I mean, I thought it was unrealistic. 
when I've seen the change beyond imagination. I would describe it as a very valuable service to someone who's maybe looking to be mentored in, in that they could get the help and support that they need in a way which is not telling them what to do, it's them actually deciding what to do and, and being given informed choices. I speak on the phone to every fortnight, every week, for every fortnight, to a fellow in Cumbernauld. He's now 93 and we have a long chat about football and different things like that. Mm -hmm.